Power 93.7, WBOK, the People Station. Back at it again. Your boy still about money. Plugging you in to another dish of the 716 Spotlight. Brought to you by Easy Loan Auto. And I have the one, the only, Nale. What's poppin'? I, I said it right, right? Yes, you said Ooh. it right. <laughs> I'm not going to tell y'all how long I've been practicing her name. Judge I'm Zone. screaming. <laughs> so glad you would come up here and chop it up with me. Thank I was brought you here with your EP Ecstasy and your joint um, Can't Stop Staring. Yes. Mm-hmm. And I saw you perform at Vibrations. And I can't lie, I couldn't stop staring. You was yeah. at so uh, for the people who don't know, how old are you? I am 21. So where does your 21 dancing sing yourself come from? Where are you from? Um, well, born in Buffalo, raised in Lackawanna. Uh, that's where I went to high school. I graduated. So, but I mean, majority of all my family in Buffalo, a lot of my friends, a lot of stuff I do out here. So how long you been singing? All my life. All my life. Singing. Sing. Oh, come on, come on. Y'all better not tell me. I'm telling you, I got some vocals up out of here, boy. I can hum my butt off. I tell you, now, you got the whole like Aaliyah type vibe going. To be 21, you give Dang. me like this whole early 2000 type. I mean, yeah, I grew up in a real R&B household. You know, my parents in the industry. My dad. Lead singer of Cool in the Gang. Dope, you know, dope. my mom acts, sing, dance, she do it all. And basically everybody that play an instrument, do music or something. So it really was something that was just Oh, so y'all the two thousand Jacksons. Huh? <laughs> 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 Who got beat with the switches? Come is the on, question. With somebody. Got, all right, just free zone, just free. I, I digress. I digress. <laughs> so um so you sing, you dance, like what is your, your first love? Is it the singing or is it the dancing? Um, I think Singing for a fact was definitely my first love. That's what I started doing before everything. I mean, I started dancing when I was three. My mom threw me in studio, all the tap <laughs> classes, ballet, everything. So, and then as I got older, that's when I started getting into acting more too. Okay. And that's when I found a love for that also. So, that's why your videos give me like this uh, lifetime movie vibe. Yeah, huh? yeah you know, a little, a I, little like it, I like it. Oh, I'm going to be in the cameo in the next one. Come hit, on, hit, I'm going to need hit, you in there hit, now. Wow, see, it's on camera. So, now you have to do it. You have to do it. So when it comes to the singing, like, were you always good at singing or did you suck at one point and then get some training? Like, what happened? Actually, no. I've really always been good at singing. I think just the more music that I listen to, artists I listen to, and singing those songs at the time is what helped my voice grow over time. So honestly, I really didn't start taking vocal lessons until when I went to college. So once I went to college, they give you like a vocal teacher, and that's when I really started to see my voice grow even more. Well, you're like, oh, I could make some money doing this. Yeah, I I was like, wow, I didn't know my voice could really do all this stuff. So I definitely would recommend having a vocal teacher for anybody that wants to sing because it definitely helps. Now, being only that you're 21, oh, you're a baby. Um, What's your musical influences? Who you look at to say, you know what, that's how I kind of want to be, but put my own little sauce on it. Well, I, I mean, I always say like, Brandy is that's the vocal I Bible right be there. Down. Come on, that's that's mom right there. She is who I listen to all the time. So a lot of my stuff I definitely got from her. But I also listen to a lot of Aaliyah too. So I feel like that's where a lot of like my swag and stuff come from as well. I could definitely feel the Aaliyah yeah. swag. So definitely, it's definitely feel it's, it. it's like a mixture of them too. Those are my girls. So so what do you bring to this R and B scene out here in these streets? I mean, the funny thing is, I don't really label myself as an R&B singer. I feel like I'm a mixture of pop and R&B. I feel like my sound is real pop, but my voice is what makes it R&B. You better talk that talk, you girl. Feel me? Home, so, you're supposed to brush your shoulder off when you say something come play on. like that. There you go. Teamwork made the dream it. work. Yeah, so I feel like I give it that mixture. It's like redefining what a pop star is, you know? Every, I like people that. look at pop stars and they think of like Ariana Grande and Katy Perry, and it's like, nah, we could be pop too. We got some chocolate pop yeah, stars. What the hell? Throw a little hot sauce on you it. Know. And we, gotta, we get it going. <laughs> So, now, um, your project your song um, Can't Stop Staring What's the The message behind that song It kind of seemed like That was written to somebody so uh, you know, shit, no? Well I mean I write all my songs for, Okay So everything comes from Like my own experience Or just like Anything So when it comes to Can't Stop Staring I actually wrote that About someone I was dating at the time And I feel like any, it's, I feel like it's that stage when you first start talking to somebody, you just can't stop staring at them. Get the butterflies yeah, all you in get your the belly. butterflies in your feelings. You adore every little thing about them. Even his little stink breath in the yeah. morning. Yeah, all that good stuff. All that. <laughs> Ashy hands and stuff like that. You still be like, you're still cute though, babe. Even though you look like you've been making sugar cookies yeah. all morning. You Stop still cute it. though. 
and that's and that's just how it is. When you first meet somebody, like even if something like, are you single? Are you taking? Like you you ask little questions like that, getting to know someone, and then you start to hang out with them more. And you're like, dang, like I, I just can't stop staring at you. Nah, are you still staring at him, or you are you you oh, not staring no. at him? Not at all. Right, no. You know, <laughs> <laughs> no. And you don't get no writer's credit. All right, <laughs> you, you out there watching right now? Yeah, not at all. But what I do like about that song, I just like the honesty behind it. To where it's like we all been there, and yeah, I feel that's like. A fact. Definitely relatable. That's what I like about my music in a sense of, especially as being a female, it's a lot of stuff that we be thinking that we don't say. Mm -hmm. I'm just that one that happens to say it. Like, I don't care. I'm going to be straightforward. I can't stop thinking it. I can't stop thinking about you. I can't. Stop well, you know, I you. think about myself too. Now that you mentioned it, you know what I'm saying. Come I got just. Oh, you want to talk about me? I'm sorry. <laughs> I digress. But no, it, it is important to get that female perspective, and for someone to be honest, that's why we listen to people like you, so you can give us that yeah. view. You know, some people might be scared to say it, but you're not. Not at all. And uh, speaking of scared, a little birdie told me um, you're a Brandy fan. Hmm? I love hmm? Brandy. So first time ever. We gonna play a little game, all dun, right? Dun, dun, dun. How well do you know Brandy? <laughs> okay. see, see, see my game voice. See, see my game voice. All right, five questions. All right, you ready? And no, you can't help. This ain't oh phone a friend. Now, since we are so low budget here and cheap at uh, Power ninety three, um, you don't win nothing. You don't uh, win a damn thing. Okay. But we get to spread this love okay. to everybody watching. All okay. right, kind of made up for it, right? Mm, deep. Okay, that makes sense. Kind of, kind of, kind of. All right, <laughs> we gonna start this off real easy. Any Brandy fan will know this. What's Brandy's full name first? Middle and last. You know, it's crazy. I sure don't know her middle name, but I know her her first and last is Brandy Norwood, though. But I don't know that middle name. It's Clip. Um, I got it written down, but I had this problem with reading sometimes. My hooked on finance ain't come in yet, so I'm sure I'm gonna mispronounce it. Just so, uh, Ren Renana. Mm. R A Y A N A. That's probably why I know it. Yo, <laughs> see, look, didn't even know. See, I just blew your brain, right? Come on, <laughs> you blow it. I knew the first and last, though. But. All right. <laughs> Question number two How well do you know Brandy? Mm -hmm. What was the first TV show Brandy starred on before she ever dropped the album, record, anything? Moesha. First TV show. The first TV show? I gave you a hint. It's not Moesha. It's not. It's not. It's not no. Moesha. It's not Moesha. First TV, TV show. I'll give you another show. hint. She was a youngin', real little. See, cause you only twenty one. That's like you, the thing. Y'all gotta give me young. some credit now. I don't even know they do. They do reruns now these days. You kids really? don't get reruns, do y'all? They don't even put it on Netflix. Like, they'll mess up your whole life. It was Thea. <laughs> Thea was an old show. Um, I was, I was young too. Mm. Lord have mercy. Deep. Um, I was Thea was a comedian. One. She was a comedian. Wow. Brandy was a little girl on the show. Wow. Boom! You over two down. <clears throat> I ain't say nothing. But this no. is really interesting. Though. All right, like, all right, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> This is the hardest question on here. Oh. How many siblings does Brandy have? She only got one brother. Are you sure? Yeah. Do you want to phone a friend? Nah, you're right. I'm just BSing. Yeah, you're right. You're I'm right. Like, you're right. I'm like, what? I'm like, they hiding somebody else behind the curtain? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no, nah, I'm standing down with it. <laughs> Way to believe in your gut, huh? <laughs> uh, all right, two more, two more, two more. Um, in 1996, Brandy went to a prom with what future Hall of Famer? Dang. Mm, 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 you know what's mm, crazy? Mm, mm, I don't mm, know his name, but mm, I know she went mm, to prom mm, with him. Mm, mm, it was a basketball mm. player. I'm not going to get it. Kobe. Name. Really? Yes. It, it was, was Kobe. 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 What? Mr. Bryant, before he got into I the white I wonder how girl. that went. Yeah. Uh, it went good because he got drafted the next year. I'm sure he was happy. Yeah. He was out of high school, you know? I really All right. do remember that. One more. Now, this one, uh, I'm not going to tell you how long it took yeah. me to look up this Brandy trivia, so I'm real proud of myself. <laughs> <laughs> one more. Uh, when she was younger, before she recorded an album, her debut album, she did background vocals for what group? You're not going to get this because I ain't even know this. You know what? I know I'm not going to get this. Did Immature. You, Immature. Marcus Houston and them. What? <sighs> Immature. Now, uh, disclaimer. If I'm wrong on any of these answers, I looked it up on Google. Don't That's be mad at me. Don't be in my inbox. Be mad at Google. Yeah, I, I did that. I did. Okay, Don't be judging nah, me. Wait Why a are you minute. doing that? Wikipedia not good to use because huh? anybody can put that stuff on Wikipedia. But I, I mean, I use like three different sources. Mm. I'm, I'm, a, I'm on my Donald Trump. He did his what what happened was... <laughs> <laughs> now, Tell everybody listening, uh, where can they find you? Social media so they can stay in tune to all your latest um, projects. All my social media accounts, my ad name is Nele Mignon. N E L L E M I G N O I. Yeah, because we're all filet mignon. So that's going to help y'all out. <laughs> and they could get the project Ecstasy where? Where can you they get can it? You can get my project on Apple Music, Spotify, Tidal, Amazon Music, Google Play. You can get it on everything. 
definitely check that out. I'm sure I know you guys gonna like. It. I, I know you are too. So that's how we're gonna highlight this young queen for the next two weeks. It's all about you. Front page of the website, front page of the app. Uh, so make sure y'all check her out at WBOK. Dot com. I still got my game voice on. Come on! on. Well, so still about money. Here's my last two cents till we meet again. Chase the dream, not the money. Dream Thanks. it, believe it, put God first and achieve it. You know the steal. Mama, I'm on the radio.